Which brings us to North Carolina and Bank of America Stadium here in Charlotte. Coming up, we've got what should prove to be a good one between the Tennessee Titans and the Carolina Panthers. Here's the former Florida Gator, Eddie Pinheiro, to get us started. And off we go from Uptown Charlotte. Coming out of the end zone, here's Dontrell Hilliard. And this return will net positive as he gets past the 25 and up to the 27-yard line. They'll come out with a three tight end look on the first play of the drive. 19, driver, 19, alert, alert. They'll start on the ground. It's Derrick Henry. And he'll push his way forward to about the 32. The game's first play produces six yards. Brings up second down. Again, it's Henry. And he is met in his tracks behind the line of scrimmage. A loss on that play. And now the down gets tougher. Front and six. An interesting and intriguing decision there defensively because they kept extra DBs on the field despite seeing the multiple tight end look that came out for the offense. I thought they were going to switch out of it. I didn't know if they felt they didn't have time or what the case was. Well, in any event, the extra speed allowed for great penetration as they stuffed out of the line of scrimmage. First down, Titans gain of 12. Well, there's plenty of real estate for him to maneuver on that run, and let's face it, it shouldn't be a surprise. He's one of the better backs in the league. Had to come into this game with the idea, slow him down, otherwise it's going to be a long afternoon. And he'll power ahead, but only for about three yards. Second down coming up. Well, that's just a pile of bodies there, and that's when you kind of find out who's a tough guy, right? Who can stand up and make a play? It was only a three-yard run, but for both sides, they had to walk away from that field like, okay, I can stand up when the goal gets tough in here. And he'll lose yardage on the play back at the 45-yard line. It'll be a loss of a couple on the play, so now third down coming up. This size, he's a tough man to bring down, but they do a nice job there stopping his progress and not allowing him to get back to the line of scrimmage. first quarter. The Panthers turn to their nickel set here as they get ready for third down. Running from the gun with Henry. And he'll take this to the 47, but no further. As they get him down well short of the line to gain. Only two yards, and it'll be a punt on their opening possession. And the big fella stuffed that one up in a big way. I think doubling him has to be a priority because you can't move up to the next level if you don't take care of him first. Going on fourth down, here's Willis. And they're going to try the screen. It's complete. And unable to break away. They stop him a few yards shot. A surprising move here on the opening drive of the game. And this defense delivers a turnover on downs on the very first drive of the afternoon. They start on the ground with McCaffrey. And he'll lose yardage here. Back at the 47. Two yards the loss, second and 12. Oh, he fakes a spike. It's just a gain of a couple there on the scramble, and now it's third down. The plan was clearly to challenge them by sending a blitz on second down, but even the extra guys couldn't catch him in the backfield, though. He doesn't scramble for a first, but he does get the last laugh by evading the blitz and getting beyond the line of scrimmage. Now throwing on third down there, but he cannot connect. That was their first third down try of the game, and clearly something was off in the execution of that play. Good news, they've got a whole game left to clean that up and start clicking on those key third down throws. Now Mayfield on fourth down. 
Oh, that's into a sea of bodies, and it's intercepted. Picked off by Amade Hooker. And the Titans are going to get the ball back on the turnover as they hold on fourth down. Before we came up to the booth, last thing he said as we were walking off the field, want to play mistake-free football. Well, that just went out the window there with a the pick. And do you remember what you said to me when we were walking up to the booth after he said that? You're like, oh, fatal last words. Every time we hear that, things tend to fall apart a little bit, and that's what we saw there. Didn't get enough on that throw, and it turned into an interception. Five yards is the tally on first down. That brings up second and five. They'll run it again with Henry. Only a couple there as he'll be brought down about the 28. And this is why, of course, the defense coordinators love the blitz. It makes it happen because they don't take more attention to the blitzers before you have to D-line them to make the play. We're scoreless after one. Sometimes those lines that are drawn on a grease board or in a playbook, they come to life <laughs> out on the field, don't they? And we just saw down that outside handoff to the right. That right tackle, he gets excited for that call, doesn't he? He does, because he just wants to dominate his guy and say, listen, I was the point of attack. I took care of business. That's why you're able to get downfield and add all those yards to your total. Yeah, really nice gain there. So the completion results there in nine yards, and that'll give him a short yardage situation here for second down. Open man, Westbrook Aquino. And he'll be marked down right at the 20 yard line. I like watching the wide receiver screen because it's a real teamwork play. Because guess what? The guy catching the ball, he'll get all the credit. But how about the people up to block in front of him? Either fellow receivers or offensive linemen. That makes that play a really nice timing play, and sometimes it can break big. And they run the option here on first and 10. And a good gain here of nine from the 19 down to the 10. Well, that's what he can do when he keeps the football. It's not a huge gain, but it shows how hard it can be to stop it. Yeah, and I thought the defense had that one pretty well contained, and in fact, they probably came up and felt pretty good about what they did. Then they looked up and realized he still got good yardage out there. He's a tough guy to stop. Tenth carry now for Derrick Henry. And he will have the first down before he's brought down at the three. It's a nine-yard gain, and it'll keep the drive moving. And that's the big fella's M.O. right there. Running through tackles, keeping the sticks moving forward. This defense, if you don't bring 11 guys to the ball to try and get him on the ground, he's going to keep making runs like that. I feel the press box shaking. And this time he is in. Yes. Derrick Henry from three yards out. And the Titans post the first points of the ball game as they take the lead here in this second quarter. Bullet good on the extra point, and it's now a 7-0 game. Now Bullock will send this one away after the touchdown. Here's Roberts to bring it out of the end zone. And he'll be brought down right on the chalk of the 20. This Carolina offense at the line, ready to go. They threw an interception the first time they had the football, wound up leading to a touchdown the other way. How do you approach drive number two? Going back to your game plan coming in, Everyone has matchups that they like better than others, where they think they have an advantage. Dial up some of those plays. Try and go to those spots and get your offense moving. 
And he's brought down, getting this one up to about the 35. On first down, this is McCaffrey. He'll get a nice chunk there on the first down run, and it's second and four. Now Mayfield. Toward the sideline, and look at that catch. Dragging the toes, and that's going to be a first down. Well done. Line of scrimmage, the 31 now on first and 10. Throwing, Mayfield. He's got the hookup. It's Chenault on the crossing route. And he's down into the red zone at the 15 after a gain of 15. First and 10. It's caught. It's Chenault again. And the Panthers are looking at first and goal as he's tackled all the way down at the two-yard line. They'll try to run with McCaffrey. And he is in. Touchdown, Carolina. Christian McCaffrey as the first half is winding down. And the Panthers have a chance to tie the game here in the final seconds of the half. Pinheiro's extra point up and good. And that is going to tie our game as we approach halftime. So I'll leave it at seven now as they kick it away. Hilliard now from his end zone. And ultimately, he stopped right where he would have been if he had simply gone down to a knee at the 25. The Titans offense set to begin the drive. And with time quickly fading here in the second quarter, not sure how aggressively, offensively, they want to play this. I think we'll find out just how much they trust their guys in this situation if they decide to take a shot. Throwing on first down, but this one winds up to be incomplete. That was an interesting look there because as soon as he got outside the pocket, I thought he was going to take off and run for yardage. But what often happens now with these quarterbacks who can move, defenses want to try and keep bodies in front of them, and I think that discouraged him from taking off and made him try a pass downfield that fell incomplete. Time for a break. We've hit halftime. Two quarters down. Two still remain. We step aside. This is the NFL. And he scores. Charles Davis, I'm Brandon Gordon. Set and ready to go for the second half. One touchdown apiece, 7-7 our score. Taken in at the three. And a good return as he'll be stopped just shy of the 30-yard line. The Panthers out there and ready to begin their next drive. It's a tie football game here. What do you think, Charles, the message was at halftime? Well, I think that they probably just looked at things and said, we're fortunate that this is a tie game. No need to panic. No need to change a whole lot. We didn't play anything close to our best in the first half, so we don't have to go out and win one for the Gipper. Let's just go out and play our best football and win one for us. After the pickup of five, here's second and five. They stay on the ground, McCaffrey again. Just a couple on the pickup there, and now it's third down. Here's Mayfield. Able to complete this to Chanel. Down the numbers, there he goes. Touchdown, Carolina! Well, we know that he can beat you in a number of ways. 
He can catch it short. He can take it long. Or he can do what we just saw right there. Catch it and then run with a football. Yeah, and this just looked like a simple, ordinary play to start. But boy, did things change. Once he got free, it was off to the races. And once he hit high gear, there's absolutely no one who was going to stop him. And you can see the distance traveled there after the catch on the next-gen stats. Now he's back out there to boom this one away, maybe with some frustration after the PAT miss. Hilliard now from his end zone. Oh, a good return up past the 30. Solid return, pretty good field position. They'll start at the 32. The Titans offense set to begin the drive. And yeah, they'll be working from behind now following the touchdown a moment ago on the opening drive of the half. I think the guys right now, as they go out on offense, they're zeroing in on one big key. They don't have to do anything differently just because they're down on the scoreboard now. The intent, still the same in what they plan to do on offense. To throw on second and six. Willis, this is Jeff Swain, the tight end. And able to get this one across the 45 before he's brought down. First target, first catch, and a first down. Running left, it's Henry. No gain on the play there, second down. It's rare that a man his size can't at least push forward for a yard, but they stopped him there for nothing. You're talking about Tiny? <laughs> you talking about the little guy back there? That monster. Yeah, you're exactly right. And it takes a group effort to get a guy like that down and not let him find some space. The first guy in, he's got to take one for the team, right? Because he's just waiting there and holding on for everyone else to help him out. Only five on this play to move the sticks. On third down, Henry. They picked up five yards last time. Now they double it and get 10 here. First downs have not come easy, and neither have runs like this throughout this game. Absolutely not. He finally felt like, whoa, a sigh of relief. We got something going in the running game. Looking to set for Woods, and it's intercepted. Picked off by J.C. Horn. And they will be set up now as he brings this thing all the way back inside the 20. They brought the house that time when the young rookie maybe a little rattled through the pick. And you have to be prepared for a lot of pressure as a rookie quarterback because most defensive coordinators are going to test you that way. Touchdown, Panthers. D.J. Moore from 17 yards out. And the Panthers are able to strike quickly to add on to their lead. Mayfield going to try to throw for the two. And this is going to be caught. It's good. And that extends their lead by two more. Now after the touchdown, here's Pinheiro to kick it off. Hilliard now from his end zone. And tackled at the 21-yard line, so a net negative there of four yards. Titans offense set to begin the drive. As this offense takes the field against CD, remember last drive, they were moving the football, but then they threw that costly interception, so we'll see if they can right the ship here on this drive. And doesn't that just sum up football? We see it all the time, don't we? The defense goes from losing the battle to making a huge play and stealing the momentum. So you know they're riding high right now, and they're ready to challenge this offense and that quarterback one more time. And we'll see if the offense is up for that challenge here as things start to get more interesting here in the second half. And he'll be out of bounds across the 30-yard line. First target, first catch, and a first down. Willis headed left off the option, and he will lose yardage here to the 31-yard line. See the athleticism there of Brian Burns 
stopping him behind the line. And as they come to the line, they will not be able to get off another play as time has run out on this third quarter. This is the National Football League on EA Sports. On second and 12, Willis. It's incomplete. Took a shot, couldn't connect. Give it big credit for his coverage right there because when he saw the route break deep, he stayed in position to prevent a completion while holding any risk of a flag. The Titans on third down. That had been near perfect. Four for five to this point. This is third down and 12. Trying to set up the screen and it's intercepted. And he will bring this one back. It's a pick six for a Panther touchdown. 